All right, we're trying a new product. Movable fencing is absolutely essential where we are because we're gonna change fields from time to time depending on who's doing what, a little bit of rotational grazing. Now, what I found about this product right off the bat, and I found out about this from Alvina, look at the amount of spacing in between these substantial posts and the metal on both ends. I really like what I see here. This is stouter, nicer. Yeah. Way nicer. Really like what I'm seeing so far. And again, we're just testing products as we go along. Now this is for a cow and a calf. They're finally on their way tomorrow. And they suggested, because of the nature of this cow and calf, they're fairly docile and they're trained to electric already. This will give them enough juice to keep them in. Now this is sheep and goat, do you know that? Really, nice. This is for sheep and goats, so it's a dual purpose if we need to use it for the other. Now I have a little power pack over there that I hung on the tree. I'm just gonna take a battery and attach to that. So far so good, I really like this. I it's do easy. Too. It's not getting tangled up. It's about 500 degrees out. Mm -hmm. The pig pen which is gonna come in handy if we need to like get her in here, if we have to do some other stuff out here. Move fence, that's a good idea. Yeah, so we can put her in here, bring her some sweet feet in, let her get, you know, let her and the calf come in here. So being that we have plenty of pig in the freezer, lots and lots of pig in the freezer, right. this will be handy. What do you think about this fence? I like it a lot better. It's got posts that are closer together. It's very stout on the bottom. Did you notice yeah, the metal? Yeah, very sturdy, right. And you can turn that metal. I'm digging it. Yeah, I like it. All right, we're almost done. One left and the cow comes tomorrow. Cow and the cow comes tomorrow. Yay. Right, let's get one more section in. <laughs> 